So here I have all the storage types on the left hand side and uh, we have the feature set and how it's going to vary based on the certain types. So let's just quickly uh, look through this to see where there are some uh, standouts. Uh, and you might want to actually review this at the end of this section just so uh, you're a bit more familiar with uh, all these types of features. So it clicks a bit better, but let's just quickly go through this. So you're gonna notice for version one, this is the only case where you're gonna have a deployment model of classic. Everything else is gonna be the resource manager. From a practical standpoint, you're not gonna really notice because you're just gonna be pressing buttons, but underneath, um, that's the only case where it varies. For replication, you're gonna notice that uh, version two has the most options with replication. And if these don't make sense, don't worry, we're gonna cover all the replication in an upcoming slide. Uh, for uh, blob block storage, you can see it's very limited. Same with file storage. Um, so that's there. When we're talking about access tiers, how quickly you can access files, you're gonna notice that it's only available for general version two and blob storage where we're choosing these different tiers. For these ones, it doesn't really matter um, because, well, especially with like a file storage because the drive is as fast as it's going to be, right? Uh, for performance tiers, uh, you're gonna notice that with version one and version two, we have standard and premium. When you're using file storage and block blob storage, you're always using premium. And with blob storage, which is again, a legacy format there, that's gonna be using standard. Uh, blob storage comes in three different types and you're gonna notice that uh, based on what you wanna use, there'll be some variation there. Um, I don't know where page is, I think that they both support page, but there are three types in there. I wouldn't really worry about it too much. Uh, you're gonna notice that file storage only supports file types, and then you have version two, and this pretty much uh, supports everything. So you can see general purpose version two is a really great um, uh, storage to choose.